Hello Taurus, this is Bonnie from Soul Star Bliss with your May 2017 mini tarot reading. Let's take a moment here and um, let me wish you Happy Mother's Day and those of you that are having birthdays, Happy Birthday. So we're going to take a little shuffle here and do a mini reading for you for May 2017. Let's see what we've got here for you. Please remember this is a general reading, and if you'd like one just about you, please stop by my website at www.soulstarbliss.com and we'll get you set up with an appointment. Oh, also, you may want to check your sun, your moon, and your rising sign here. Now let's get started here. Oh, I've got the Nine of Cups for the first card, which means this could be a really good month for you. Don't give your power away this month. Trust yourself. It says do the things you truly want to do. Um, when you make this about you, everybody else around you is going to be happy. So do the things that make you happy or benefit you, and that will flow outward, those of you that are in a family. So it says we're going to focus on ourselves, and uh, when we're at joy, bliss, and ease, guess what we bring to the situation or to the family or to wherever, to friends, to work, whatever. It says it doesn't matter what's gone, it matters what's left, and there is something left um, I'm not exactly sure. I think that's in the relationship department. So where sadness was, there could be sunshine, happiness like a child. So um, don't make any rough decisions regarding uh, or tough decisions right now on relationship. I think you're going to be shown something. That's not for everybody, but it is for some of you. It says getting ready to make some choices for other things, though, is a good thing. It says plans that you have been working on, things you've wanted to do. You know, promises you've made to yourself might be a good time to start working on a lot of those or putting those uh, into action. It says it's easy for all of us to make plans, but I have a feeling some of you are actually going to put them into, uh, into action and it's going to bring you a lot more than you thought it was in a good way. Um, it says a lot of talk could be needed right now and it will change things. Okay, that, I feel that's uh, in the relationship department or family, uh, either one. So it says talk could be real important this month and it says speak the truth. Speak how you feel um, by giving someone an answer of you, what, you, what you think they want to hear could totally be the wrong answer. So kind of trust yourself in how you're feeling about things. It says don't be swayed by others too much either this month because you're going to be shown a lot of things. It says spirits working with you or walking with you. It says your prayers are being heard. You forgot you're a chariot, one who achieves greatness. And those of you, if this is your birthday month, birthdays traditionally I have found over the past years is that birthday time can be a real lucky time for, for people. It says it's a time to gather with those that you love. Um, don't cut yourself off. Some of you are, you know, feeling some kind of sadness where you just want to be alone. And I feel that if you get to where the people are or the family, the friends, wherever, it'll make it much easier for you. Not make it much easier, but it'll make it better for you. You'll feel a lot better. So it says preparedness in reverse. See where you've got, you've come from. See how you got here. It doesn't matter, you know, where you are. Well, it matters where you are right now, but if you can, it doesn't matter if you can't see how things have progressed to get you here. And I'm talking about those of you that are going to make some decisions about your situation. Before you do anything, look to how you got to where you are, and I think you're going to see um, some possible avenues that you haven't seen before. It says you're afraid to make some choices, but you're going to. It says you're going to make, if you make them about you, put you foremost, it's, it's going to be very good for you. Those wants, wishes, and daydreams you've put away, it's time now. Bring them out for yourself. Um, what you're waiting for is here. It says don't wait anymore. Although there's gaiety in the midst of change and things seem to go up, I'm all excited. They're going to be great and poof, fall backwards. You know, I, sometimes I have to say that's just part of life. But it says there's going to be gaiety in the midst of change. And the important word here for, I believe, some of you is there is change. Things are going to change. They're going to get better. you got the wheel of fortune. You've got to have everything you need to put your plans into action. That's pretty awesome. It says people are going to try to tell you or sway you one way or another. You know, it's good in a relationship or where you have to uh, work with other people and such is to get everybody's opinion, but still it says you will make the choices right for you. And when you make the choices right for you, it'll be right for those around you too. So you've got the sweet victory card here. I mean, you're so overdue for a victory, Taurus. It looks like it's coming. Make sure you trust your intuition because it's going to be very, very good, very sharp, very clear. And it's going to lead you to a lot of victories. 
It says, don't worry about what other people are saying, especially those from the past. Just because someone says something, let's just say someone says something negative about you, just because they say it doesn't make it so. When you pick it up and carry it, now you've made it so. So let's just say here, it says apprenticeship, you're working on yourself, this is a good thing. There's changes for you, they're already being put into place. It says choices you're making right now, you're going to see uh, the benefit of. So keep doing what you're doing. It says, uh, or what you've started, don't slip back. It says you've been working hard, continue to do so. You're strong, Taurus. It says abundance is certainly could be yours. And remember, abundance isn't always money, although it can be. It can mean joy, bliss, and ease. It can be what you're wanting, things that you need. It says home is important to a lot of you. Home is going to have a big improvement. And home can be a cardboard box under a bridge. It can be a house. It can be a mansion. It can be an apartment. It doesn't matter. But wherever you call home, it says you're going to do some uh, changes there. And changes can be as simple as the way you look at things. It says it's going to be much better for you. It says that feeling of being alone could be gone. You're going to be making some agreements official agreements with those close to you and again that could be home or work I'm not sure uh, it could be a partnership but it says what you want is there for you so don't give up yet happy birthday Taurus happy Mother's Day to all the mamas this is Bonnie from Soul Star Bliss thanks for dropping in and we'll see you again next month